Bernalillo County District Attorney Carrie Brandenburg is going to be meeting with the state Supreme Court this week. Yeah, she wants to modify that 10 day rule that we've been hearing so much about. That's the one where a case is dismissed if all evidence is not ready in 10 days. A lot of repeat right. offenders have been getting back out on the streets because of this. Action 7 News reporter Sandra Ramirez is live downtown with more on this request. Sandra. Well, Todd, Marissa District Attorney Carrie Brandenburg says this deadline is a strain on the system, and she's not the only one who agrees. Now, here's how the rule works. Now, as you mentioned, evidence must be turned over to the defense in 10 days, or the case is dismissed. Now, so far, judges have dismissed more than 300 cases. That means accused criminals are being put back on the streets. Now, charges can be refiled once all that evidence is ready. Now, last week, more than 15 Republican state lawmakers wrote a letter to the Chief Justice asking to change the 10-day rule. They want to give investigators 60 days to turn over the evidence instead. It will give more time for district, the district attorney to file charges. Folks are being released back out in the public before there is really a consideration of the merits of the reason they found themselves in the system in the first place. Now, state lawmakers will also have public safety in mind in January. Senator Rue says lawmakers will introduce a three strikes bill that gives people a mandatory sentencing if they are convicted of three felonies. Reporting live in downtown Albuquerque this morning, Sandra Ramirez, KWT Action 7 News.